I think Tony, uh, the best brand ambassador is your employees. Mm-hmm. Um, and so before we embark on an aggressive, uh, you know, external marketing campaign, you know, there's a saying, charity begins at home. And that's, that's true. Right. That's right. You need yeah. to first build a strong uh, employer brand value mm-hmm. proposition mm-hmm. before you manage your reputation outside of the company. And so that's how I strategized, you know, uh, during that crisis. We need to uh, take care of the core, uh, and that would be employee experience. Mm-hmm. And then dovetail external communication about, you know, who you are as an organization. What do you stand for as a brand? You know, there's this um, acronym, which is ESG, that we came to know as the Environment, Society, and Governance, right, yes. Tony? But I think it could also mean employees, society, and government. Nice. Yeah. Speaking from a public relations executive, a communicator, mm-hmm. I would prioritize my employees first before anything else. Mm-hmm. And um, you know, given this pandemic that we are in, I would always tell my leaders and uh, the man from, what are we doing mm-hmm. to give uh, our employees access to vaccines? Are we looking at the safety and security of our employees? That's also part of the the stakeholders that we need to prioritize. Second would be society. You know, how are we contributing to our communities? Are we a responsible corporate citizen? What is our social impact uh, agenda as a company? And finally, government. Mm. Uh, there's another saying that I'd like to, you know, share, which is mm-hmm. cannot sue City Hall, <laughs> which is also true. Mm-hmm. Um, I've uh, been, you know, working as a government affairs executive for a long time already. And I think, mm-hmm. again, it really helps that you are uh, a responsible corporate citizen and you find platforms to partner with government. Mm-hmm. Are you, uh, you know, also helping uh, agencies of government who have, you know, mandate to, uh, you know, take care of the education uh, of, of uh, your talent pool, for example? Mm-hmm. Are you working on, uh, you know, uh, sustainable, measurable and replicable social impact initiatives? And all the more during these times of transition and during this time of uh, pandemic and health crisis, we need to really strengthen those um, core uh, mm-hmm. social impact initiatives 